pass the syrup cuz we are about to dig into a few different and delicious waffles that you can make at home. To learn how, we turn to Chef Mario Gibran of US Egg. Let's start with the waffle mix. That'll be our base. So for US Egg's waffle mix, you're going to use 3 fourths cup all-purpose flour, half a teaspoon of baking powder. Follow that up with one and a half tablespoons of sugar, an egg, a teaspoon of vanilla extract, and a cup of milk. Whisk together. You don't take the air out of it by beating it too much, so you want a little thickness there so you get a nice, crispy, airy waffle. And remember, it's got to sit for at least 30 minutes after you're done. Now we're ready to cook, starting with a high-protein waffle. What we add in is an egg-based protein powder. He used vanilla, but he says any egg-based protein powdered flavor will taste great. Make sure it's mixed up really well. Then it's time for the waffle iron. All waffles will go for about three minutes. Top with unsweetened dark chocolate chips, banana slices, and serve with a side of fruit. Next, we're switching it up with a vegan Hawaiian waffle, so get ready to substitute a couple of ingredients to the batter. It's really important to have the right consistency in your batter. You don't want it too thin, you don't want it too thick. To make it vegan, he says switch out the egg with a quarter cup of unsweetened applesauce. And instead of regular milk, chef says go with water. And you want to go ahead and put your shredded coconut right into the mix to make sure you mix that in there really well. When it's ready, top with almond butter, pineapple, and voila. Finally, let's satisfy our sweet tooth with a cheat day coffee waffle. I actually have coffee grounds. It's Kona coffee that I put right in the batter. You gotta give it that really good mix. You want a smooth texture so your waffle comes out just right. Into the iron it goes, and when it's ready, serve in a bowl, cuz. This one is actually topped with ice cream. Follow that up by pouring your favorite hot coffee on top, and you're good to go. Time to get your grub on with these yummy and simple to make waffles. <laughs> 